Countdown is on. St. Joseph's Day is just eight days away, which means it's time to celebrate with some traditional pastries. Zapolas from the original Italian bakery are here to and here to explain the history of the tasty treat are Tanya and Kristen Audette. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks happy for having us. Yeah, happy to have you guys here. Tis the season. It already smells great. Um, Tanya, let's start though by talking about the tradition behind yes. this and St. Joseph's Day yes. all together. Well, here's a history lesson. <laughs> Um, St. Joseph's Day, that's why we celebrate it. It's because of the fact that back in the day in the 16th century, um, they had famine and drought, um, no rain at all. So mm -hmm. what they did was they ended up praying and praying and praying to St. Joseph for rain. And lo and behold, obviously we must have gotten rain because here we are today, yeah. bring it on the legacy. Mm -hmm. And so did they bake these pastries um, like as a, as a thank you and celebration of, yes, of St. Joseph? Yes, they did. They promised him a feast. Okay. So that's what they came across because once they got the rain, um, in return for a thank you, they mm -hmm. had a nice big feast of Zeppeli. Yeah, and Kristen, you're the, the feast is happening now at the original Italian bakery, so it's talk been about Zeppeli season. Is, is there a certain season that you guys um, see, a, see a peak in sales? Uh, mostly right before St. Joseph's Day and mm -hmm. like Easter also. We sell them in Easter time. Okay. And then we also have like the Bailey's um, Irish cream zeppola. We have the yellow boiled cream, the pistachio, and like the whipped cream and the raspberry. We also have chocolate too, but we don't have it here in the future. Mm -hmm. Well, that's nice. Yeah, you've really um, expanded the the offerings that you guys have at the bakery and gone into some some different uh, flavors. Do you have a personal favorite? I personally, I like the original traditional zeppola. Yeah, personally. Um, and the traditional zeppola, there's even um, a story behind the shape of it, right? Yes. Which I didn't realize before. Well, this is interesting. St. Joseph was a carpenter. Mm -hmm. So his tool was he had a plane that he would file stuff down and do whatever he had to do with. Mm -hmm. And the handle was in a replica of a zapola. So huh. that's how that came about. That's how the, the shape yeah. was I created. Find it interesting. Yes. Um, and I know Kristen was mentioning of how like there is this, this peak, obviously, right around St. Joseph's Day and then even a little bit further into Easter that you, that yeah. you guys see well, a lot of folks picking them up. But you said you sell them... Oh, well, time. we sell the traditional all year round, mm -hmm. all year round. Which is unique and, and unlike a, a lot, lot of, of different people. places. Sometimes it's just that special kind of month time yes. frame. Yes, but we sell that one all year round. Mm -hmm. Then we come up with the varieties. Um, we sell, we start getting the varieties and probably about a month before. Okay. So to hype everybody up yeah. to put their orders in and things like that to get started. Well, that, that's a good day. reminder. Yeah, if you're looking yeah. to purchase a lot of them, place an order and then you'll yes. be ready to, to pick them up. Always place an order. Now, what is this? It's our jumbo <laughs> zipola. Oh my goodness. Yeah, right so over if here. you want, yeah, a crowd pleasing. A dish like that, do you slice it like a you, cake? You can. You just kind of pull it apart? How does a it work? A lot of people cut it in like fours. Mm -hmm. um, pretty much that's what they do with that one. Yeah. Um, but, uh, and they're all served in that traditional way, then topped and with that little that little maraschino cherry. Yes, the like four inch diameter. Mm -hmm. um, you put your favorite cream or your custard in there. Yum. You top it off with a powdered sugar and a cherry to make it look beautiful but and it doesn't last that long no and <laughs> not lasting that long they were our roadie deal of the day if you noticed it online and we didn't even have a chance to mention it because you already sold out there's they Jeez. go so so quickly um so roadiedeals.com always has a uh, great roadie deals to look ahead into the future to see who else has one coming up but don't forget you can always Get your Zapolis at the original Italian bakery 915 at Whatever Johnston come see us there you go